Hello guys and welcome back to Saints Row. In this episode, we're trying to make the plan happen. You enjoy. Okay guys, welcome right back to Saints Row 4 and let's just do... Let's do this. Meet the crew. It's time. Are you ready to tear the simulation down? Sure thing. Let's do this. What was that? Uh, the reception's gone shitty. Look, just spread the word. We're meeting at Kinsey's. This is amazing. So we're tearing down the simulation as you heard. Oh, Christ. that's pumping now. Um, yeah. <laughs> Boom! This is a fun head. Okay, let, let me focus. Let me focus. Let's go to Kinsey's warehouse and. I'll meet the crew and basically we'll start fucking with the simulation, fucking with Zinyak and I hope we'll kill him as soon as possible. Get me. Shit. Here we go guys, Ooh, a new car, this fucking car, shit, but fuck it. Oh, man. Zinyak got him, fucking Zinyak, I hate him, I hate him. I mean, yeah, this game is fun though, and Let's see how the fuck are we going to fuck with this simulation. We have quite a lot of guy people. We have a plan that I have no idea yet. Look at this sprint to the bar to the house. To the barn. I mean to the war to Kinsey's warehouse. Who's empty though? I mean it was. What's up, guys? I'm not late to the briefing, am I? We haven't started yet. I'm waiting on Miller. I still feel bad about punching Matt in the face. He'll get over it. Or he'll kill me in my sleep. That's always a possibility, too. Got what we got, guys. Can we just get the murder in already? We got a problem. Now we're talking. What's up? The Zinn are coming. Here? That's probably why he said it's a problem. All right, let's take cover. We should be able to ambush them. Not so sure about that. Do you have guns? Oh, I have super bars. I forgot. Watch out! They're using some sort of suppression grenade. They're probably trying to counteract your powers. Powers? No powers. It doesn't matter. They're dead. Kinsey, any ideas on how they found us? I don't know. Who cares? Let's just kill them. On top again. We have to kill this, by the way. And this is pierce. Like the cool. Oh! We have to pierce this one. There's too many of them! There's a helicopter on a nearby roof! We 
We can use it to get everyone to safety. This way. Matt and I will head out on our own. We what? Take care of your people. We'll catch up. Stay safe. Before we do anything, we need some breathing room. Let's take out those tanks. <laughs> and I will hold them here. Just get everyone else to safety, player. We got this! Whoa, why are we running? I'm down for some murder. We can murder later. Right now we need to get the plan back on track. Whatever the plan was, it went out the fucking window. We need to focus on surviving. No. We need power, though. Because power are amazing. Go. Get to the chopper. Go, go, go. Check it out, a UFO. And that from the start. UFO. Yo, here's some banner getting into that car. Let's cover him. Sounds good. The center flying in. Where? Enemy ship flying in. What's the best way out of here, Kinsey? Okay, um, hold on. I'm scanning. Scan fast. Yo, these Zen have some high-tech shit. What's so awesome about them? Oh, the Zen have all kinds of cool stuff. I wish I could get into their armory and see what they're prototyping. They even have murder bots. Murder bots? Now that's my kind of household appliance. Spaceship! Yeah. Good stretch of the muscles, eh?
shit, I need to get back. We need to find a safe place for Pierce and Ben to go. We're not going to my place. Still no powers. Everyone okay? We walked away, right? Oh look, a cat. Is this a pet store? God, I wish it was. Super and climax. Who names this shit? Where to now? Doesn't matter. The Zin just found us. We gotta get out of here, Kinsey. On it. Ooh, is that a killing floor? Merry Christmas to me. Uh oh. Christ, what now? Boss, the game is on. It started by itself. I can't shut it down! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very special episode of Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax! Okay. Big money, big prizes, I love it! The floor is active and the doors are locked. Nobody gets out. Including us. Until that is, the contestants rack up enough points to fill the murdometer. Shit, I'm down. Let's do this! Done already. Okay, so basically, I'm shooting aliens. The whole game. Let's. I mean, look at all the contestants today, and all new targets as well. The Zen Empire have taken it upon themselves to face the challengers. Truly, a bold move on their part. You're not kidding. The Zen are the fiercest opponents in the universe, Bobby. They should be a tough fight for the Saints. Yes, indeed. The Zen are falling before the might of these contestants. They sure are. Look at how they're mowing down the opposition. Yeah. Just to show you how much having a team behind you can really come in handy. <laughs> I wish we had a team behind us. What we have is the love and support of Zinyak. What else could we possibly need? Nothing at all, Bobby. Nothing at all. Oh my god. No. Just a little bit longer. Bobby, look! Professor Genki has entered the arena! It's always a special occasion when the professor takes the stage. Let's watch the master at work. That's Genki, huh? Yeah, he looks crazy. Now's our chance. Kill him! Boss, he's kind of helping us. The man cat must go! Good shot by the contestant. Genki's sure gonna feel that one. It takes a particularly skilled player to take on Professor Genki. Especially after facing the considerable might of the Zen Empire. Of which we are required to extol the virtues. <laughs> and there you have it, folks. Genki is down. Down, but never out, Zack. So true, Bobby. So true. Is that all? Looks like it. Oh my gosh! Is everything okay? Let's get to the prize room! That was fun. They got more games like this in Steelport? 
they do. But right now, so oh. where to? You know, I generally don't like getting involved in things, but this is really exciting. Yeah, I get it. Life beyond a computer is mysterious and beautiful. Now, can you snap out of it and tell me what we're supposed to do? Ben's plan was to overload the simulation. We can still do that, but not if the Zen know our every move. Can you come up with a workaround? Yes, but I need to get back to the ship so I can find a way to cut them off. Once that's done, it's just a matter of finding the weakest point in the simulation. Sounds good. Let's go. How'd that work out for you? Flamethrowers, please! Okay. Roadblock up ahead, guys! Okay, okay, okay. Hey, hmm. Clay, Pierce and I are Fuck. pulling out of the simulation. Meet you back on the ship. Kids, is that normal or is someone messing with our connection? I don't know. Whoa. Whoa. What up, Zinyak? We're fucked now, by the way. Uh oh. Kinsy? You alien fuck! I think. Oh my god, no! No! He took a Kinsy. Now. Okay, we're fucked now. Our plan is. Oh, what the fuck are you doing? They got Kinsey. Boss, the dinner here. What? We were set up. I got out of the simulation. Pierce and King were out cold. The proximity alarm is screaming, and Asha Miller and the vice president are gone. I could not keep that and left us sleeping so we get picked up by Zinya. Too bad for them, we're awake. Only three of us now? Fuck you. And we need to get on. Um, can I get the robot, please? What's the plan? Okay. Secure the room. I'm checking on Kinsey. We'll save you, Kinsey. I promise. You ready? Because we got visitors. You shoot them. Fuck. Have any other guns? Okay. I have a pistol. Oh, I have this. Touch pumping now. Let's clear out the lower decks. We have to hold the room. Fuck that. I'm not waiting for them to come to me. Okay. Bots, are you kidding me? Yep, oh my god. Hello? How are ya? How you doing? What, over already? Nope. <laughs> what the hell? We're moving. Why are we moving? Let's get to the bridge. <laughs> Shit, are we driving into the sun? We need to figure out what the hell is going on. No need. I have already analyzed our situation. Shit, I forgot Mr. Deix Ex Machina was even on the ship. A Zin transport has attached itself and is dragging us toward what I assume is certain doom. Any bright ideas on how to keep us from dying? If I were you, I would deal with the strange heat signature by the cargo bay first. Cargo bay? Fuck. Let's go! Johnny, why are you so slow? Get off me! 
Shonday! Let's fight them. That's right, I'm better than you. Is Kinsey okay? Everyone's fine. The Zin grabbed me and... Hey, Zin said something about heat signatures? One of them put a device on the wall. I'm not sure what it is. We got bombs over here. Bombs? Yeah, and they're set to blow. You thinking what I'm thinking? Keep an eye on Kinsey, Shondi. Johnny and I are about to do something really stupid. You got a specific thing you want to blow up, or just shit in general? Kinsey, what's the weakest point on this in shit? Yo, boss. Kinsey's... Fuck. I... Look, we'll just find the biggest, glowingest thing on the ship and stick the bombs to that. These Zen sure do make a good argument for murdering. He's in your can't hide forever. When I find him, he's gonna wish he fell on his own sword. Take your time, huh? That sounds like a plan. I'll get the chance. I'm gonna rip Zinyak's goddamn head off. Yo, where do you think the Zen had Kinsey? When I find that Nasha, I'm gonna beat that information out of them. Will you even try? Yo, we got some alien gun over here. Hell of a welcome back, huh, Johnny? Fuck, you were thinking I wanted to go to Hawaii or something? I live for this shit. And Hawaii is gone, by the way. The song. Biggest glow. The ship is big, by the way. I can't lose that. Large red cylinder. Big and glowy. Looks perfect. Here you go. I need to find something that looks important. Let's blow this up. 
Could be better. The fuck was that? Yo, these bombs are hotter than we thought. Go, Let's go. get the fuck out of here. Yo, quit fucking around and get in here. Last minute. That wasn't a bad fuck you to Zidiac. Now let's get out of here and find Kinsey. God damn it! What happened? MI6 fucked us. I knew it! Asha had it out for me since jump! She talks shit in Pakistan, she sucker punched me. Can't believe Miller had me fooled. To think I actually apologized. He's probably been working this angle for a while. Hell, he might have even been the one who tipped off Zidiac about Johnny. Doubt it. Dante said that the lowest circle of hell was reserved for betrayers. But it's important to remember that it's the storyteller who decides who the hero is, not morality. But while philosophers will spend years debating the ethics of the Kinsey Gambit, the Saints had a less charitable view. Heath David is a dead man. Oh my god. It's one less and kind of fucked. We don't have Kinsey. Guys, I'll end the episode here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.